Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to another Let's Play Dark Souls 2 and we've reached a new area that looks pretty damn cool I have to say. It's kind of like a underground lake of some sort and I have no idea what this place is in relationship to Majola or anything. It just looks pretty damn cool. And we entered this tiny hut last time and uh, ran into this lady here which I assume is the one who was singing before. We knew you were coming. And stop singing. We are Milfanito. We are here to sing to those bound by death and dark. We will sing here forever. As we always have from long, long ago. We know nothing of the world outside. And why should we? For we will never leave. Do you seek King Vendrick? But what is a king, after all? We know nothing of the world outside, for we will never leave here. When we sing, the little ones dance. The little ones grant comfort to those who bear death and dark. This is what we were taught. Is there anything wrong? Well, you could say that. Everything in here wants Perhaps to kill me. this will help. Smooth and silky stone. Well, thank you very much. This is all that we can do. When we sing, the little ones dance. The little ones grant this. The little ones, eh? I, I'm not sure I want to meet the little ones. Is that kind of tiny midgets that want to strangle me, perhaps? I have a feeling that it's definitely not, not something that's going to be friendly towards me, so... Yeah. When we sing, no, I want to... Uh, I want to read the message. To those who bear this. Thank you. Read message. Leg? You know what? I don't really know. Maybe she hasn't got any legs. It kind of looks like she's just... plonked down onto the ground, just glued into the floor somehow. Maybe we can have a bit of a closer look at her. She's awfully tiny, and it does indeed look like she is missing both her legs. But what do I know? Well, let's carry on. Maybe we'll run into the little ones. Hopefully not! You freaking goddamn curse and I hate you! I wish I could murder you with arrows, but I can't! I'm gonna have to run out of here. I'm freaking... Yeah. Beat you to death, and let's just hope we can run over there without drowning or something. And I think we have the edge. Yeah, it's just placed by the edge there. That's really nice of you from software. Thanks! <laughs> Alright, let's explore this area this time around and see if we can be allowed to have a look around here. Oh, there's no. I thought there was items down there, but that was actually just a reflection. Right. Uh, I don't know. Can I walk over here? I bet they do this on purpose. I'm going to be looking down into the water here. I'm and then something's going to jump up and freaking murder me. Or maybe not. Alright, that actually worked just fine. Let's see, what do we have here? We have one of those guys over there, which is bad, so we're going to get rid of it. I think we have another one. Over there. These guys look like they belong in a Cthulhu game or something. They would be fit in right there actually, so yeah. Uh, a whole bunch of those cleric looking dudes. Hope I can just aggro one of them. Not sure what these guys are all about, but I don't really want to find out. Oh, 
All oh, right, she started singing again. I can't see anyone dancing though. Hmm. All right, this looks like a potential trap. Here's one of those guys. See if we can lure this dude over here. Kiana, show us what you've got. I'm not impressed, sorry. Not at all. Arch Drake robes. All right. Smooth and silky stone. I'm supposed I should go to Snugglies the Crows and uh, do some trading. This guy, we're going to try and just straight out fight. What? Why didn't you lock on there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it easy. I'm gonna scratch your, your back a bit. More to the left, you say? Alright. How's that? Good, good, good. Useless items all around. Archway gloves? Alright, that's kind of nice, though. And we have another one of these things. The Cthulhu divers, or whatever we want to call them. And I think there's another one over here, or maybe even two of them. Just for the sake of it, I'm just going to see if I can get a lock on and use some fire. I don't think it's going to be <laughs> particularly useful. No, not really. Is there, what? Is there one or two? No, I think there's just one, right? Yeah. I've got some items over there, I th Or maybe that's just a an opening. We're gonna have to try and look around here and see what where we can go without drowning pretty much. And I can hear something. Chest therefore left. Okay. I think I know where that chef chest chest is located. I'm sorry, I have some sort of speech impediment today. I don't know why. Right. Carefully gonna walk out here and get that. Oh, is this a mimic? Just gonna check the blood stain. No, he just falls off. <laughs> but we're still gonna try the to test the chest for any type of mimicry. Dragon charm. I uh, don't quite remember what that is. Right. Pretty sure there's going to be a lot more stuff around here. But we are going to try and have a bit of a look around it. I'm not so sure I want to do that right now. We are probably going to move on a bit. Although I do find this singing rather soothing. We just hang around here all day pretty much. But we're not going to do that for, for the sake of you, my dear audience. Is that another fog gate? Oh shit, what the hell was that? Mm, I don't like the looks of this at all. There's another one of these lazy mushrooms. I'm not sure what these guys do. And there's a whole bunch of... Is that those Cthulhu guys? It kind of looks like it. Yeah, I think it is. Hmm. Try eliminating one at a time. That sounds like a really good idea. I think lightning do a fair amount of damage against these guys. No, I'm probably going to stick to that. Good thing I bought some more arrows, actually.
Right. Human effigy. Thank you very much. Oh, what's that? Hmm. Like a very small passage. Interesting. I can't get in there. Give it up, fatty. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm going to write that. That was actually a pretty good message. No trap, please. No trap. Thank you. Twinkling Titanite. Yes, I think I have three Twinkling Titanites now, so I can actually upgrade either my uh, Drangleg Mail or my pants or indeed my shield. One level. They are freaking hard to come by, I have to say. Now, what the hell? Is this another boss fight already? Not so sure I want to do that just yet. We are actually going to go back here a bit and maybe have a look around the sea area. And maybe... Maybe a torch would be a pretty good idea, come to think of it. Yeah, I think this will make it a lot easier for me to see where I'm going. He says, and then immediately drowns. Yeah, I thought as much. Can't go on here. Just gonna see if we can find the perimeter here pretty much. Oh, well, what do you look at that? Another chest. Crimson water. All right, maybe not totally worth it. I still can't remember what that does, and I've got a whole bunch of it, I'm, I think. We are going to try and find the perimeter, and I'm just going to keep speeding this up. How about that item that we saw up there? Can we somehow get a hold of it? Maybe, like, shoot it down or something? Can't see it anymore. There it is. I'm just going to try my bow and maybe I can have it fall down or something. I'm going to shoot this guy. Yep, that worked very nicely indeed. Why didn't I think of that before? <laughs> I bet it's going to be a torch. No, Twinkling Titanite. Excellent. Good. Very good indeed. And we're just going to try to continue this way and I'm definitely going to waste... I'm not going to waste the flame butterfly. I'm going to go over here and light the torch. I don't have to waste a flame butterfly, actually, so... Whoa, shit! I did not see you. Where the hell did you go? Oh, yeah, there you are. I'm sorry. We're going to have to put an end to you. Thank you. And, of course, I'm going to have to relight my torch. You bastard. Looks like... Whoops! Jeez! Where the frick are you? There you are! I'm just going to settle with some arrows to your face. And could you guys just let me, please, look for the perimeter here without you constantly interrupting me. It's getting a bit annoying. <laughs> oh, here it is. Oh! Check it out! Oh, damn. No, not like... Th oh, that's the... I hope I didn't break the chest. No, I didn't. Good. Good! Elizabeth Mushroom. Alright, alright. Let's go back and relight the torch. Oh, thank you very much. All right, I'm going to say that we have explored or have, have pretty much exhausted the um, this area. So there seems to be no way of getting over to the uh, other side of the lake or the other sides. So we're just going to have to go through this fog gate, which I'm going to assume is not a boss fight. There should be messages and... Uh, well, there is one. Let's see what it says. 
Boss ahead in short weakness thrust. So there is a boss fight anyway. All right. I suppose we're gonna have to get ready for a boss fight then. Uh, I've got some combustion and stuff left, so why not equip that? And maybe just gold pine resin up here because I like that. It seems to be pretty effective. Or maybe it's not really a boss fight. So that was kind of a waste. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I think I know those guys. Stop doing that. Stop shooting crap at me. No, 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 no. Ah! Damn you. I think that's actually... Uh... Oh, God. Damn it. It's necromancers, I think. And they're just gonna keep shooting crap at me. They never stop. But you know what? I can shoot crap at you as well. Trouble is I... Oh, I've got the range. I thought I couldn't reach them. But I can! It's pretty interesting to, uh, you know, thing I've noticed that they kind of lower the resolution of the animation when, when an enemy is far away from you. The movement is really not very smooth. I suppose they do that to kind of, you know, save on power for the poor old PlayStation 3. And let's not forget to heal. Oh, this place looks really nice. We are going to carefully have a bit of a look around here. Hello, I didn't see you. Cthulhu man. Oh yes, a bonfire, thank you very much. And these guys. Come on out of the water so we can fight. Ah, they are pretty damn ugly. <laughs> so we're just gonna light the bonfire and then have a bit of a look around. Oh shit, I thought I was gonna drown there. Um, I don't like this really. I think there's another necromancer somewhere around here. I thought I heard something anyway. Yeah, I think that's one over there. Or maybe it's something else. I'm not sure. See if we can... Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Can I kind of... get you here? Oh, he's gonna hit me, but I'm just gonna take it. Hmm, it doesn't really look like it's necromancers. Maybe it's something else. Yeah, this is a cool looking area. I have to say, I like those flowers. And I bet there's like a ton of secrets around here. And I'm going to go back and get a bonfire because, yeah, I have a feeling this is the perfect place to just kind of drown. Hmm, that's interesting. Oh yeah, it is. I thought so. If we walk over there, we're going to drown. Yeah, okay. I kind of thought, uh, let's run up on this thing here. But that, I think, would have meant that I would have drowned. So, good. Or maybe I can run down there. Maybe I'm just going to go back and get a torch so I can see something. <laughs> I think that is a really good idea. Alright. That should do the trick, right? Looking good. I think I can actually move out there. Oh, hello there. Uh, why did I do that? Why am I using the bow? Because then I extinguish my torch and that is... So I'm just going to run back and light it again. Uh, guys, you just never tire, do Just never give up, right? Stay ugly, bro. Stay ugly. <laughs> Can I get up here somehow? Maybe I can do a little bit of a jumping here. 
Oh shit. No, oh my freaking god, I'm so sick of this. <laughs> Come on. Oh die, leave me alone for five minutes and why did I miss there? Why did I miss you there? Alright, let's see what we can see from up here. I can see a Pharaoh's Lockstone, that's for sure. At least I think it's a Pharaoh's Lockstone. And since we've got a bunch of them, I'm definitely going to go down there and check out what happens. Better be something good. Maybe more than one. No, it's just one. Alright, Pharaohs. Eat it! Eat it! Eat the stone! Hmm. Right. All right. Treasure ahead, pretty much. Helix Halberd. Uh, maybe I'm just going to have a quick peek. Helix Halberd. Scales D with Dex. Uh, let's see what it is. A halberd with a helix-shaped handle headed, w headed with a double blade. A complex design some would say excessively so, that hides a spear within its handle. Although its precise origins are unclear, its construction appears to utilize techniques from the lost land of Olafis. Eh, alright, not so exciting perhaps, for me. Maybe I'm just going to leave a bit of a message here, so people actually can see this lockstone. Alright, treasure ahead I think should be pretty clear and for some reason I can't see the mess maybe I'm gonna have to put it up here I'm gonna try that and see if that helps no you still can't see a sign when it's underwater which is kind of annoying and now I've extinguished my torch again but frankly to hell with it I'm gonna waste a a moonlight butterfly, I almost said, but what, what do you call them? A butterfly, fire butterfly, or whatever. So I don't want to have to run back anymore to the bonfire to do this. Alright, let's just carefully examine this area because I have a feeling there's going to be more secret stuff. The bad thing is, of course, I'm just kind of looking down here, trying to figure out where I can move and not move. And that means I can potentially get slaughtered by these guys. That worked out for the best. Pretty much. Hmm. What the hell is that over there? That's looking like it's something really big. Is one of those cyclopses, maybe? I think it is. I haven't seen them for a long time. And I can't see I've been missing them, really. I just don't at all miss them. What the hell? Is this a doorway? Ah, oh, this area is pretty damn huge. Let's go back and pick up that item. Over here, I think it was. Yep. Fire seed. Oh, ah, uh, oh, it's one of you guys. Sneak, sneak, sneak. No, 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 no. And there I extinguished my torch yet again. Damn. <laughs> now, where the hell are you? Stop shooting crap at me. Oh, I think he's confused somehow. I think I can... Oh! They just never stop firing. And that should be the end of you, right? Thank you. Thank you very much.
and yes, that is most definitely one of those fat Cyclops dudes. Hmm. I wonder if they are at normal strength or they are more powerful. I see blood stains, and I don't like it one bit. Oh shit! No. Oh no 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 no! Wow, I thought as much. You are not getting me this time around, you fat bastard. No, you're just not. They do a ton of damage. You know, maybe we should try and uh, experiment a bit with fire. Oh, could you lock on? He's right next to me, for Christ's sake. Could you just lock on? Why are you not locking on? Why? 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 He's right there. Lock on. Lock on. I don't know why this is not working, but it's not locking on for some peculiar reason. Could you please? This is just impossible in water, apparently. So, you know what? Apparently my bow doesn't lock on either, so screw you, you fat bugger. I'm going to try and poison you, even. Yeah, that worked just fine. And the lock-on still does not work. He's just immune to lock-on, apparently. Strange. I was able to lock on to the other dudes. So I don't know why this is not working, but yeah. Yeah, you're not getting away, just so you know. You're just not. I'm going to shoot you in your eye. Oh, and then he just turns around. <laughs> oh, yes, I just love my poison arrows. Please just die already. I'm kind of concerned about his grab attack still. I think he does a ton of damage with that. And he hasn't even got the decency of dropping anything when he dies. That's just sad. Ah, this area is pretty damn huge. Gonna have a bit of a peek in here. Another bonfire, maybe? No, not really. Felicia the Brave? That does sound like uh, an NPC. I think it is. Possible boss fight coming up, I think. Up. Oh. Whoa! No, 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 no. No funny business. And who's firing at me? Damn you! Where are you at? Yeah, I think I see you. Ah, uh, yeah, guys, I think we're going to end the video about here because we're up to about 30 minutes or something like that. So, uh, yeah, we're going to move forward the next episode and see if we can find the next boss fight, which I, I kind of have a feeling that it's going to there's going to be a boss pretty soon. But we'll see. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe and all that. And I will see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.